256 kbps up and down is the minimum definition. Our research shows that in fact many broad broadband products that say that they are giving various things don't even meet this minimum criteria. As one of my friends says, this is not broadband, this is fraud band. Indonesia is a research organization. I mean, we do a degree of advocacy, but that's those two go together. So what we do is we develop the method. Now our peer review is actually from the stakeholders, from the operators, from the regulators and so on. While we are doing the research, we also try to influence the outcomes. The basic concept was that it would be a crowdsourcing application. We would have the, the software available, people would download it, it would all go into a database. Then we'd take the averages and then we'd have a picture of what was actually being performed. Best aspect of it, of course, was that it, it's a very good diagnostic tool that uh, regulators can use to diagnose what the problems are and what could be done. So we've done it in Chennai, we've done it in the suburbs, the outskirts of Chennai, uh, we've done it in Colombo, we've done it in Dhaka, we've done it in Bombay, we've done it in Delhi. We've got a real problem with international bandwidth. Uh, that performance drops irrespective of the country when one is going to an international uh, destination, when one is downloading from the internet cloud. And in fact, that is one of the main topics that I, I brought up when I was invited to speak to the South Asian regulators in Tehran recently. We had a two-year period. We didn't go public. We kept it more or less inside. Uh, we gave the software to the operators, we invited them to meetings, we engaged in public discussions with them. And then when we felt that the thing was stable enough, then we went public and we went public with a bit of a bang with uh, advertisements in newspapers. The initial reaction was that the operators were you know, very, very, uh, uh, very cautious. But we managed to get them to the table. We managed to get them. We said, we'll give you response time. We won't go to the media. Come to the meeting. Let's talk. And they agreed that the basic method was sound. Uh, we kept tweaking it. Indonesia has been measuring the broadband performance for the last couple of years. And I strongly believe that it's a very good initiative. Uh, and uh, it has actually helped uh, service providers not only locally but even in the region to exactly understand the benchmarks. When we responded with evidence, not ranting and raving, which many people do when they respond, with evidence, uh, we found that they were quite receptive and in fact we influenced the, the outcome. Not 100%, but in the policy game, you know, 75% is a win. So we basically positioned the Indian regulator, some aspects of what the Indian regulator was doing, some aspects of, this, of what the Singaporean was doing. And we ran ads when the region's regulators were in Colombo, so that we would reach all of them. The most important thing about uh, the kind of advocacy or communication that we do is that we want to give the best possible evidence. Best possible evidence, in my view, is develop a method that somebody else can use. Replicability. We are working with IIT Madras. I think anybody knows that this is a prestigious uh, engineering institution. Uh, that gave us, gave credibility to the message. On the actual communication side, I think we've used multiple methods. Uh, there was this sort of two years quiet period when we were engaging with the operators, getting their buy-in, getting their feedback to stabilize the, the method. We were gentle in a, in a sense about how we took it out, but when needed, we actually went after them with you know, name and shame advertisements. It was a mix of techniques. And I think the, the real uh, test, I think, is that the regulators, nine regulatory agencies represented in the South Asian Telecom Regulators Council, uh, saw it fit to invite me to talk about this subject in Tehran a couple of months ago. That's, I think, a sign of, uh, sign of, sign of success. So we've been balanced in our approach to this, and I think the operators understand that. You know, it's the operators who give people connectivity. Uh, we have to work with them. Regulators help, but in the end, it's these people who give the connectivity. We are rethinking the whole question of how we measure uh, 
performance on the mobile side. That is where the the, the device is 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 moved. Uh, with regard to the fixed side, I think it's settled, and the operator, the regulators can just do what they want with it. It's it's ready. We are now dealing with the unsolved problems on the other side.